Welcome back. Here's a story for any dad who perhaps struggles when it comes to one specific parenting practice, doing your daughter's hair. I love this story. It's about a dad in Johnson County who's been there and is now offering a free solution. Our TV6's Ann Kelly explains. Every morning, this is the scene in Josh Weichel's Greenwood home. Can I see the comb? He and his four-year-old daughter, Ella Rose, working together on anything from a ponytail to a French braid to her favorite, Princess Leia buns. It looks like a doorknob. Weichel can do letters of the alphabet, post his own tutorials online, but he hasn't always been this skilled. All of this self-taught a couple years ago. It was kind of like my responsibility as the at-home parent, where I, I didn't want to send her out with, quote, dad hair. But Josh says this isn't just about making his daughter's hair look nice. It's about the time he gets to spend with her while he's doing it. Braiding time is bonding time. She may be playing her game or coloring a book, but it's still one-on-one -on -one time for us to sit and chat. We talk about stuff and um, everything. This has been a gift for their relationship, and so now his mission to give that gift to other Central Indiana dads. This spring, Weichel connecting with a father in Florida who hosts hair braiding classes. You may have seen this viral video, and deciding to host his own free sessions. You step back and you look at the class and you just see all these dads focused you know, on their girls and talking to their girls and doing these, trying to do these ponytails, and it's just, it's incredible. As is, Weichel says, the fact that thanks to this new skill, he's confident years down the road, he and Ella Rose will still have something to bring them together. You know, and then maybe down the line, even when she's older, it's something we can come back to and sit down, and if she needs to talk or she has something to say, talk about her life, then she can come to Dad, and Dad can do a braid, and... Uh, we can connect that way. Reporting in Johnson County, Ann Kelly, RTV6. And he does a great job. What Josh calls his daddy-daughter hair factory meets next at the end of the month. If you want to sign up or find out about other classes, we have information on the RTV6 app right now. So